What's up, everybody? <laughs> we are live. Yes. And this is real. This is real life. And today on Smosh Games, we are going to be hanging out, chatting with you guys, while also playing the most badass hard game in the video game world. Brats, flaunt your fashion. Yeah, it's been on our radar for a while. Yeah, it's been from on my personal radar. FromSoft really went all on this. <laughs> it's my favorite Soulsborne. <laughs> yeah, they really went crazy. I, I do have two friends who voice in this game, and I'm very proud of them. So Laura Bailey and uh, <laughs> and Matt Mercer are both in this game. No, they, uh, my friends voice Jade and Yasmin. So whoever, if we get to choose, I hope we get to do. I hope one you play of those. as a custom brat. Oh, can you do that? I don't know. That's can you be your own in Bart? Any game. Agreed. I love making the custom character. I thought I had this awesome idea for a uh, for a series where you like go into a character creator and try and make the most fucked up thing possible. <laughs> Apparently, it's already a thing. And it's it's a popular. very successful thing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was like, man, we should do that. Um, speaking of ha ha ha, uh, we have our <laughs> chat on. We have our chat on. on, and what else, Spence? What about Should the chat? Spencer, I believed you for a second. I don't even know what I said. That's the thing about the, the delay. The Mercer and stuff. Oh, yeah. Uh, no, I mean, look, they could be in anything. For a while, it was Troy Baker. It was Troy Baker and uh, Nolan... North. Yeah. Tanya North. Uh, but yeah, guys, so we're... we're so people are... Uh, yeah, so this is... We're trying... We're, we're going back to streaming. We're going to try and stream, like, once a week. Um, we're trying out this time. Uh, if this time has been working for people. It seems like people are... People are, are, no one's saying, people are saying they're, uh, 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 sorry, we, we haven't live streamed in so long. I'm full. <laughs> uh, you're, doing, you're doing the Donald Trump thing right now where it's just like, you know, I hear people are saying, everybody's <laughs> saying that this is the best time for them. I've heard that it works. Everybody's saying, you know, I've heard, so it works. So this is the time that is the best because we've heard that. So thank you for being here. Yeah, for right now. Right thanks, now. Thanks for RSVPing to the stream, guys. Respond s'il vous plaît. You mentioned Super Chats. Yeah, so we're also doing super chats, which is a, a it's it's a feature on YouTube where if you can donate, you can highlight. Oh, the other, their Smosh Games just said it. So uh, super chat lets you have your message highlighted for a donation. It kind of works in a way similar to Twitch. Are we allowed to say Twitch on YouTube? Well, you did. I did. <laughs> that's a red dot appears on your head. <laughs> uh, like a harpsichord drops from say, above. Our VOD is going to be available. Yes, they will be. They are automatically going to be uploaded to the channel. So as soon as this is yeah. done, people can like anyone can come view this. Anyone. For free. Yeah. Anyone. Uh, and yeah, we'll be reading your chat while we're while we're playing this very very cool badass kick ass we game. We will be cross eyed. Uh, that's it. Uh, we'll see you later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> All right, we gotta go now. Who needs to play first? Oh, man. You play. <laughs> yeah, okay. you do it. Have you guys ever ripped a controller out of someone's out of someone else's hands? Yes, no. but only for their own safety. There was a there was big drama in my middle. <laughs> middle. It was on fire. We used to do like our Halo land parties and like the big drama was one time. Lord. My friends did like a one on one thing. And then, uh, and then my friend like hurled a controller at my friend. We're like, dude, he could have, he could have killed him. Oh like, my god! Not, he did it so seriously. Whoa! Oh! oh. For the two bucks, y'all. Dan and hi, AJ. I uh, I once had, I went, I once went on a date with a girl who told me she's like, yeah, a guy, a guy broke up with me because I threw a controller and it snapped in half, and like I sort of nodded and I was like. No yeah, I might, I might do, I might, I might do that. <laughs> it's, it's, it's just because, like, uh, I think shattering any property because you're so angry, regardless of gender, oh, regardless yeah. of anything, I'm like, that's a lot. Guys, Kiana said thank you for playing a real video game. Thank you. <laughs> Kiana video will be game. reimbursing that two dollars. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, someone else said love the Weezer reference. Uh, yeah, didn't some of the boys? The, the ten dollar uh, super chat was saying love the Weezer reference. Yeah, we're <laughs> Lizzie's gonna put those in the, the thing so we can read those out. Can we get some brats in the chat? Brats in the chat. Brats in the chat. Brats in the, chat. Brats in the, chat. Brats in the hot dog guy. Chat. You're a hot dog. A reference. I'm, really, I'm not into bra Jonas. brat worst. So, I will throw you over the set wall. My my favorite thing oh, yeah. was uh, when I was a, <laughs> when I was a Catholic. My Catholic, you get to choose your your whatever name, your confirmation. Your brats. And oh. I chose mine as Jonas. So technically. What does this mean? Someone said, which one of you is Jonas? 
Oh, got it. Sorry, I missed that. So when we were like, pick your brat, and you were like, when I was a Catholic, I was oh, Jonas. Reading, I'm like, I'm well, reading. Spencer's <laughs> stroking out again. I'm like, we've got a nosebleed situation. Wake the fuck up, sleepy. Hey, boy. that's my friend, Ratna. Wake the fuck up, Samurai. <laughs> wake, wake, the, wake the fuck up, sleepyhead. Okay, you guys all just did my joke. Did you say that? Yeah, earlier? I said that. Well, you didn't I say it loud lie. enough. Spencer, is this your first time on Smosh Games? You make a joke, it's not loud enough. Someone else makes it louder. Everyone says that's an awesome joke. I thought Spencer took Shane out back and executed him in cold blood after he said Linux. No, I thought it was really fun. Yeah, it was really funny. okay. <laughs> Damien, how would you react if I said, like, oh, Linux? Oh, someone donated. Like the computer system? Yeah, I didn't. I never heard. The, I'd never heard someone say out loud Linux. It probably punch your stomach blood clear out of your body. Let's move around the room. Cool, See, I was man. just giggle. I just had a giggle. I had a giggly moment. Okay, man. Please okay. give me a shout out, Colleen from Pennsylvania. Hey, shout out. Colleen. Loving the tattoos, Courtney. Thank you. Tattoos. Not enough. Need more. I wish I looked like this in real life. Like a breath stop? Yeah. Honestly. They kind That's of what slay. They do to people. I, where do you keep your organs? Oh, you don't. Yeah, dude, when you have a, a waist that snatched, you don't need to worry about things like I that. Don't I don't think you need to worry a lot about your <laughs> organs when your waist is that small. I deleted my liver months ago. You keep on those eggs. I don't you try getting If I if I can if I didn't have a liver, I couldn't drink caffeine. You know you only need one lung. <laughs> Phone. Whoa. Okay. So I'm kind of into this. Sweet. Time to find the others. Today's gonna be rocking. I'm going to show you how your smartphone works. A lot of people commenting on my haircut. Thank you so very much. I appreciate you. What if Morpheus was the voice in your phone? Uh, do it. Do Morpheus. What? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm the one. Someone said they the broke movie. several controllers. I mean, look. Oh, that's expensive. Not Why, though? I've only broken one, and it was, <laughs> it was by accident, because I, I hit it against something that I thought was soft, and it... I... I, I hit it against a cat like uh like I, I thought my my couch arm was like softer. Yeah. So I like I kinda hit it like that and it just split in half. Mm. How long ago is this? Forever ago. I did I thought the drywall was soft. Would you vote at the at the time? Yeah. Okay, so that's what were you playing? it's a little too I was playing Sky I was playing Skyrim oh, buddy. and it was the part where right. you, it was the lock picking hack where you can like level that up really yeah. high. And I, it kept fucking up, and the guards kept seeing me, and I got so mad because I was like, "This is supposed to work," and it, it was like the tenth time I. Why well, won't they let me cheat? And I was just like, "Good," and I, it like, I didn't throw it. I didn't throw a controller. I think breaking it in any capacity for me is the thing. It, it, I thought it was. I thought hitting against a pillow. Like I thought it was like a pillow texture that I was hitting against. People are saying you're too strong. That's probably, That's probably what, it, what is. it was. It's probably what it was. You're just talking Sprint. I was hanging out with that voice actor last night. Dude, what if you what if you stepped on the 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 heel of your bell bottom pants and just just ate <laughs> shit? Just snapped yeah. your ankle like a baby deer. Definitely happened to me in middle school. So. Really. Yeah. Someone said, "Oh, sweet, another banger." Okay. <laughs> okay, Half Light Dark. That's really funny. Um, <laughs> she that's... just like set top. Okay. <laughs> like I'm like guys. I would never break a controller ever again. Oh, uh, sweet, another. <laughs> <laughs> I, will, I will say the like pro controllers. Those are a little bit harder to break. And I challenge you. You no. know, what? if we get fifty cents in in tips, Shane will break. It, it was. A, I think it was a very cheap. It was a PS3 I controller. Mm. Thank you, Jacob. Shout out um, to Jacob. I once uh, was showing somebody, it was my ex, all right, I'll tell you. All right. I was trying to show them Skyrim, and they immediately just started killing all the NPCs, and so I, the controller everything, I was like, you want to play this game? And then you threw it at the wall. Yeah, I, and then I threw it, and then I broke it. Uh, Jacob S. says, Smosh has helped me a lot over the last two years. Much love. Well, thank you, Jacob S. Thank you, Jacob. Yeah, man. And then Dylan said, is Big, Hood, <laughs> is Big Head Mode activated, or do they just look like that? That's just a pretzel. <laughs> These are, these are the Someone asked songs. if this is Destiny 2. I wish! Dang! This is the new, I heard the Lightfall expansion's mid as hell. My mic sounds Really? Good. I'm yeah. not wearing a mic. That's too bad. Yeah, so we're not mic'd up. We're, we're trying something different. We're trying the, the boom, so anyone can come in. Ian, I like how you her... make yourself... <laughs> hey, I just just back to my YouTube channel! Hey, I just back to my YouTube channel! Hey, this is, this is the girl from the meme. 
Is it? What meme? The meme where she's like, ew. Oh, the ew. Yeah. yeah. Wait, time out. We have a selfie mode. All right. Well, that's not really a selfie good. if your arm isn't holding it. Yeah, that's that's a. Uh, there we go. That's called nice. a photo. Else yeah. with the camera. <laughs> Who do you call them? One of them selfies of other people. <laughs> Well, it really will move it for you if you don't. Well, what is this Disney it? Dreamlight Valley? <laughs> uh, so thanks for the five dollars, Nicola. Uh, K K Cakes K Cap Cakes Capesk Cakes Capesk Ultra Blue One Two Three. Oops. Love Horseback JTV Gamer Jessica Arbet. Thank you all. Smosh hasn't helped me much, but I love the content. <laughs> okay. That's, that's great. It's so great. You guys haven't helped me at all, but um... we stand. We stand people who aren't helped by our content. I actually love that honestly, because like it is very meaningful when people, you know, whether it's like on a personal thing for social media or here, people are like, "Hey, you really helped me get through some hard times." But there's got to be some people who are like, "No, I'm entirely well adjusted. Uh, your background yeah. noise for me, but like, <laughs> thanks, I guess. Like, <laughs> thanks for being there while I cook." Yeah, I would say that I would say that none of the YouTubers that I watch help me in any way. But for real, but I do like their content. They don't. They don't help you. Bro, you gotta check out Smosh Pit. Yeah, do they make good stuff they over there? Stuff over they there. do now. Yeah. yeah. I hear there's a guy on Smosh Pit that runs really fast. You, you didn't necessarily run fast, you just had more endurance than ever. Yeah, while. look, okay, we didn't yeah. know. Guys, did, okay. you, did you watch the FBI fitness test today? I wanted to be in that so bad. I couldn't. Yeah. You wanted to, you, you you wanted wanted to, to run to and, and yeah. do pull-ups? Y'all, everybody knows here about my elastic bands. <laughs> you want to show Damien's your... resistance band? I am ready. <laughs> that's for my this. favorite. That's my favorite joke in any funeral. It surprised the hell out of me. Like I, had, <laughs> I didn't hurt my feelings. I was not offended. I was just like, huh? It's like it's so great. It was such a random thing for me that I didn't realize was a thing for anybody else. That I was just like, oh damn, okay. Ali Farid said, uh, "Hello, Smosh Games. What game made you rage quit as soon as you played it? For me, it was Human Rocket Person. I've never played that. I remember." Rage quitting, uh, I rented Dark Souls from, uh, Redbox or whatever, like, the predecessor to Redbox Oh, uh, Gamefly. Yeah, no, it was, like, it was a kiosk, and oh. I remember, and I just kept going the wrong direction. I kept going in the catacombs. I was like, this game's terrible. Mm. This game's awful. <laughs> and so I returned it. I, the one game, the one game that I almost rage quit was the freaking flight school mission in GTA San Andreas. Oh, I know. Oh, We've my talked about this. God. <laughs> so oh were, my god. I didn't even rage quit. I just stopped playing. I just never got to play again. Uh, um, somebody did ask for, since I'm here, for a depressing story. Yeah, good. So I, I told, I told some of them, I told some of them, uh, in, in our meeting just now, we're talking about the animals that we see outside our window. Mm -hmm. And, yeah. and I was saying that, um, last night, uh, last night, a, so I have a rat infestation in my garage. They, they, they got into my uh, vintage car and messed it up. So yeah, it's so war. Pissed. It's wartime, baby. It's the most unrelatable story and I've ever heard. Well, so my vintage vehicle was infested by rats again. That's why they closed the bank so, on in Beverly Hills. Uh, vintage vehicles? Just Barman. Uh, so uh, I set up a bunch of rat, tra rat traps and uh -huh. one went off last night. Uh, but no, I don't think it died quickly okay but it was because i rat. kept hearing a noise and so i think he was it sounded like a man <laughs> <laughs> the tom and jerry yeah screen. it was courtney i mean eventually oh, eventually the sound stopped um and then and then i went in this this morning and there there was a rat i, I got i got it? one of those little bastards uh, they're pretty big. It was uh, pretty big. Did it have any like spices or like food accoutrements in his hand? Just out of curiosity. Uh, yeah, did you feel ratatouille yeah, disgusting yeah, yeah. mouse? I and did. Feather said, about to call the stream hot ones. Uh, Smosh has helped me make shaky friendships at best, but thank you for the 50 bucks. Wow. Also, oh, oh, Nadia. Nadia. Yeah, happy birthday, Nadia Morgan. Oh, sorry, I could it's hard to focus on you guys and also be very immersive. No, you're in this you're game. crushing it. You're, you're already level you're 50. I have to change it. They wanted me the <laughs> options that they wanted me to with. Honestly, you're so over leveled lovely. at this point. I honestly am not living for this haircut. I think really. you could take down Godric at this point. Press B to roll. 
It's actually just someone. Whoa! I saw someone in chat saying they we should make merch about your resistance bands, and I think that's pretty. We should awesome. make just Smosh resistance. Yeah, bands. Smosh resistance. Smosh band. resistance bands. I at that point feel very used. <laughs> <laughs> if, yeah, you know what? If I'm gonna be exercising at my desk and people are gonna make fun of me for it to the point where I stop, and then you're like, let's make merch. It's the same. I survived Kimmy's pool party or whatever the hell. I'm the resistance like, bands are great. That's you working out at your desk. I think that's awesome. <laughs> Fine, give me a cut. We'll talk. <laughs> that, uh, oh, hey, Matt, that ride. He says, I love Smosh, as does my 83 year old Puerto Rican mom. She says, Bussy now. Thanks, mom. You're welcome. You're welcome. Oh my God. God, are we really doing any good in the world? Yes. <laughs> we really and helped him. He says, Thank you for all you yeah. do. All of you are amazing, except Ian. Thanks, 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 Wait a second. She didn't say that. She did say she that. Didn't say that. She said, All of you help me recover from the damage Ian does to my side. I mean, that's more, that's more like it. <laughs> Oh, I've got a cool story. So I shot a rat point blank with crossbow. Uh, it was a child's toy crossbow, so I threw it a few times, but it's definitely dead now. Well, let's be clear. It was a snap trap. They're supposed to kill instantly. Okay, <laughs> I don't want to get into this. <laughs> well, I know you like so so sticky <laughs> traps. Sticky yeah, traps I'm are inhumane. Personally. Poison is bad because <laughs> predators get into that. You don't want that. You Hazy, just want to kill Hazy. the rat fast. Shut up, Valeria. Hazy said, question for the room. If you could live in any video game universe, what would it be? Cheers to the awesome bants and vids. Uh, I mean, look, Pokemon for me. Really? Oh, yeah. Where are you living? Where'd the question go? Hang on. Uh, what, what universe would you live in? A video I'm game universe. universe. Video game, yeah. You know, my, my brain immediately goes to like, oh, Breath of the Wild, but I, I do have to remember that is a post-apocalyptic yeah. world that most people died. True. I had this conversation with a random stranger in a parking lot last night, don't ask. Um, and they- He's a Skyrim NPC. No, literally oh, like, <laughs> it, I was leaving a bar with a friend and then someone came up and they were just like, ah, you guys seem cool. And I was like, thanks. And they were like, I like your fit. And I was like, thanks. They were like, y'all like video games? And we just like started talking. I'm like, all right. All so, right, well, I got drugs. <laughs> I think that's just post pandemic life where like everybody's just like, I haven't interacted with people in three years. I'm gonna make friends with whoever I can. But we realized like, you're not the hero. Like, people would be like, I want to be an Attack on Titan. Like, I want to be like the Beyblade spinning in the sky, taking it. I'm like, you're guy number one that goes, isn't that a rock? And then whoops, and then human yeah. pudding. So like, Pokemon's a good choice because you're not going to get people wrecked. People die. I, you know, honestly, I, I think it would get old pretty quick, but the Animal Crossing universe, you're guaranteed to be okay. Yeah, but it's also boring as hell. Like, yeah, you have a job right. and a mortgage. That, that is true. <laughs> it's just like- That is true. Like, I'm picking up uh, seashells all day. Fall Guys? <laughs> Actually, Stardew Valley would 100% be. They got slimes. But you can do that. Yeah, like, I know. That's, that's, not, that's just moving to Montana. <laughs> you can just move to Montana, man. Yeah, um, someone that. Okay, well, thanks for the five dollars, Jacob S. J. Mac, Ricky, Bree, Ash, Rachel, Lizzie. It's not our Lizzie. And hey, Fanatic. My name. I'm hey. I'm hey. Citizen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but I don't think that's the Yasmin from this game. It's, no, that's Chloe. It's Chloe from Bratz. Uh, it's Dominic, guys. <gasps> it's me. And Caleb, thank you for 20 Oh, Dominic. I, no. Dominic. Dominic. Dominic Pichard. Toretto. Dominic Toretto. Um, Birds. I don't know what game I would live in. Probably, you know what? If I could be the hero, I want to live in the Kingdom Hearts universe or Final Fantasy VIII. Final Fantasy VIII would be I think it's Forza Horizon. Forza Horizon would be sick. You don't know do that. You have a car. Final Fantasy would be a rough, I feel like any Final Fantasy universe. Final Fantasy VIII, the, uh, eight is dope though, because you literally go to like a battle and magic school without being run by a turf. Um, what about, I mean, Kingdom and it can Hearts fly? feels like a good answer because okay. that's all the Disney shit. Yeah, I thought, I right? Thought Hogwarts was ran by Dumbledore, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were yeah. <laughs> um, trying to think. Uh, I mean, <sighs> oh, hello. Oh, hello. Hello, citizen. <laughs> oh, Kylie, uh, Greetings, citizen. Patlon asked, question for the room, who's your favorite Pokemon? Um, well, Chansey, easy, done. Oh, that's a good one. There's so many hot people here. Feet thick. I'm trying to find the fashion designer person. Dude, if I saw someone Ooh, running like um, that. You don't have one just ready to go? You know, uh, you know one who I, I honestly I've been a fan of over the years is Halucha. Like that that Pokemon's pretty cool. Halucha's cool. Halucha's pretty sick. Um, I don't know. 
Um, as a kid, it was Scyther for me. I thought it was Scyther was pretty sick. Scyther. You know who I, I traded my Clefairy card for a Scyther though? Huge mistake. I have a I have a soft spot for my very first Pokemon pack. I opened up and I had a holographic pincer, mm. and I never sick. came across one ever again. You never forget your first holographic. No, you don't. Mine um, was a Nine Tails. Mine was two was two Clefairies first edition. You know, so, an under, underrated Pokemon is is Heracross. Yeah. This is cool. No, that's a piece of shit. <laughs> no, no. He sucks. No, no, he sucks and you suck for life. Chansey's coolest because she's round and looks like would be the best to hug. And Blissey's cool too because they would also be very good to hug. All right, guys, um, we're going to try something insane real fast. What? It's going to be a 30 second ad break. Oh my God. And guys, we are we are very new to this. Uh -huh. So so let us know if the ad break works. <laughs> so let us know if this is okay. Yeah, yeah. we're going to all drop our masks for these 30 seconds and then start fighting. Bye. <laughs> Did it oh yeah. Did it happen? It's, it's going. We're Shoot. adding. Finally, check my phone. All right. Oh God. Everyone, Did show you know, your assholes to the screen. Keep, Nobody can see. Keeping up with everybody that's donating. Yeah, there's a lot. Oh, like also, this is this is discussion for the future, but um, etiquette. Can they hear us during this ad break? Oh, well, I think because some people might have stuff blocked, like. Hello. They can hear me people, talk like this? YouTube premium people don't have ad breaks. Yeah. yeah. Oh. So we have to do, like, we're so gonna people get... People on YouTube premium can see our assholes when we show our assholes. Exactly, the, exactly. I'm so lost. Break. I really hope nobody's roasting me about how lost I am. I, I, I wouldn't be able to... I don't think anyone is uh, super... Um, super... So, so we're back, but... Yeah, we also, we have, like, we have some awesome graphics. I don't know, like, we're gonna, we're gonna work on the, uh... Oh yeah, because that's what we were talking about. We have like an awesome stream starting soon screen. We have an awesome be right back stream uh, screen, and we also have a, a, a see you later screen. That that's oh my gosh, that's so <laughs> crazy. That's so cool. Spencer, that's freaking crazy. Look, I like the I like the new graphics. They're they're I chill. I didn't see them. I yeah, we didn't see them, like. Spencer. They we just, want to support you, but we they can't. Just, I was they being like, nice about it. No, they can. I don't want to be. What, you just found $100? I've been finding money all over the place. Because if I was to be in a gaming universe, it'd probably be Skyrim or somewhere if I'm the hero. Because I love just hoarding coins and things that I find. She yeah, found I so many you smooches to and so much money. To Harai Hrothgar. <laughs> Where the hell is this fashion design person? Well, you got to speak to them. Somebody speak. <gasps> Go bottom left. Go bottom left. Wait, they're probably in the fashion store. The one, there we go. There we go. That's See? a citizen. No, it's a, that's a fashion designer. I bet that's a, that's him. That's a citizen, guys. Uh, check it out. Oh, no, talk to him. Talk talk to him. See if it'll, see if it'll let this you. This is annoying. Wait, Wait, aren't you one of the Bratz Rock Angels? Your songs are my favorite. Name five of them. So, uh, five of them. Uh, God, this run cycle. I would put a little more time into it. <laughs> uh, Ali said, hello Smosh Games, after many episodes of Eat It or Eat It, did the show expand your taste or made you more cautious about what you eat? I mean, do I even have to answer? <laughs> yeah, I think Damien was already there. Uh, I will say, um, nothing, no food grosses there me out. Looks like it. Nothing grosses you out anymore? Can I help you? Can I? But, but I truly have grave mouth. But I think eat it or eat it has made me less afraid to eat things I don't know anything about. I think it has made me less afraid. Like, like if there's a new food and they're like, have you ever tried this before? I'm like, no, but I'll try it. Yeah. I'm not worried about it. It has not expanded my taste. Like, I, I haven't tried anything on eat or eat it and like incorporated that into my routine. Yeah, I think it requires like the opposite order because when we've gone to cool experiences where we get to try new foods, they tell you exactly what it is, where it's from, how they did it, and then you're kind of more into it and then you can kind of experience the food better sure. whereas it's like i'm putting something sh strange and new onto my palate and like and then learning what it is and then you kind of have to piece it together yeah i do i do think the vibe of eat it or eat it has kind of evolved over the years where like even you know a year or two back there was the kind of thing where like garrett fed us something and it was like oh my tongue feels a little funny he's like yeah does it feel funny and he's like yeah this is a specific type of plant it's known for this flavor and it's actually going to make your tongue feel a little bit tingly for a, yeah, a while and we're like oh that. that's interesting and new and now he's just like it's meatballs made out of fire and we're <laughs> like oh okay like that's very different. I like, love fire meatballs. It's durian with a grenade inside. <laughs> yeah. 
Uh, it's a hot dog that committed a war crime. Count Dagula has a, having a say happy well, birthday, birthday Milo. message. Uh, buh, 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 buh. And then who at Smosh? Who at Smosh has a mer March birthday like me? Mine is today. Oh, happy birthday, Nate the Great! Who <laughs> has a birthday this month? We have a list. Um, like Andre somewhere. has a birthday. It was a couple days ago. I didn't wish him happy birthday. March uh, isn't was on a purpose. big year. It's, it's, it's not a big month for us. I think year. it was September. I think September, like a million people had their birthdays. Yeah, we had a lot of saggy boys. You know what that means? Happy New Year's. And your, your parents went mwah. Yeah. They went mwah. Chris Lavornia says, hey, Smosh, if the Smosh band played at 2023 Coachella, who from the cast crew is in the lineup? Mm. Um, mm. That's funny. We, so we have, we have like been, if I, can, if I can be candid, we would love to play some music together. I, I pitched a show. Yeah. I pit, I sent a creative oh, brief. Oh, you did? About Smosh having a music special. Yeah. Is that, she would not have said that. Jesus Christ, Courtney. <laughs> it's just an idea that I would like to do. I would say that anywhere. I yeah, feel like. I would love I to. I felt like it got shut down and I'm talking about, you know, like. Uh, no, but it's something that I would love to do too. Um, and I think a lot of us here, because we also have a lot of behind the scenes people who play. Brennan plays yeah. a million instruments. I think that's a great idea to just sort of throw out here. And honestly, if you guys want to see that, please tweet at Ian. Yeah. yeah. Let yeah. him know that you insist. Yeah. Because as we all know, we're all pretty musical here. You could, um, uh, do you play anything? Um, I can I can sing a little bit here and there. And then I play video games. Um, people in the chat keep saying from uh, asking if I can do a flip. I can. I just am not going to. I don't feel comfortable to do a flip right now. <laughs> but I can absolutely do a flip. Um, so. Um, how can I ask how your splits progress is going, or do you want to say? I uh, look. I'll talk about it because I've I've been open about it. I <laughs> I have been stretching every day. My progress is is moving along. I mean it. I'm Ooh, going to do the splits. I'm going to do the splits this do you year. Have a date in mind? So I, I just said summer, and that's still my tentative mm. plan because you know I'm moving along. But like, I'm I'm being humble about it. I can't say that it's going to happen next month. You know, splits take time. Yeah, they do. Um, but I'm working on it. I'm, I, I have not faltered. I've been going every day. That's impressive. You know what? You know what you need, Shane? You need an anime rival. I'm going to do the splits before you. Okay. I, okay. <laughs> Great. Sure. Okay. I'm going to do the splits I, before you. Um, You're going to do the splits before me. Yep. Have okay. you? Are, can you stretch Why in is any funny? pants? Uh, he's, he's laughing. I'm he's not laughing. laughing. I'm not laughing. You want to do this? The way you're delivering it is probably making him laugh. Yeah, it's why is that? Why is it so funny, to Shane? No, it's not funny. You sounds it sounds like you're giggling. I'm not. I'm not giggling. Wow, that's okay. a chuckle if I've ever heard it. Me on my computer. You're goading him on, my guy. I've. I am the goat. Thank you, Courtney. See, Courtney <laughs> believes in me. <laughs> um, uh, no, you need to wear shorts. Okay. Uh, I. You know. At the beginning, when I was very inflexible, I, I could wear jeans and stuff because I just couldn't even stretch beyond like mm -hmm. my what my jeans held me in. Uh, <laughs> I was that I was that inflexible. But I'm getting to the point now where I have to wear some loose shorts in order to do it. I already see your problem. When I do it, fully naked. <laughs> At um, the mall, there's two there's two there's two moments of contact when I'm doing a split <laughs> and I hit the ground. Lauren asks, hi guys, what's a random hobby you picked up over quarantine? Also, hi Shane, glad you didn't drown as a baby. Yeah. Uh, you skipped where they said, you're really cool. <laughs> you specifically, <laughs> you specifically <laughs> skipped where they said, Shane, you're really cool. Yeah. Uh, I'm happy you didn't drown. Uh, thank you for that. Um, you picked I, up a bunch of hobbies. You made some bread. I, I did start baking bread in the pandemic, and uh, mm -hmm. I, I wasn't in the, there was the initial early lockdown where everyone started making sourdough. Mm. I didn't I didn't make bread then. I started making bread um, 2021. Nice. And uh, super fun and honestly easier than I thought. And uh, really great. Uh, highly recommend because getting some absolute fresh bread out of the oven is the tastiest thing on the planet. Hot uh -huh. yeast. I, I've talked yeah. about it. Yeah, I've talked about it before. Yeah. But beer bread, literally, even I don't you, mess it up. You have made, made beer bread, and it's really good. Oh. Yeah, Shane brought some cookies in the other day too. Those were, they were those were yeah. Uh, yeah. Loises. Yeah. Any other hobbies that y'all did? I started therapy. That's a pretty cool hobby. That good is, hobby. It's somewhat of a. It's what's. Yeah. Hmm. Was that in the in the pandemic you started? I mean, we're in the pandemic now, my guy. Well, okay. Ian, do you want a chair? No. 
Do you want a stool? No, because I, I have to, I have to it's leave to in a minute. I have to leave in a minute. I don't think I, I don't think I ever, I don't think I ever talked about it, but I don't think I'm going to, I don't think I'm going to get good at it because I thought maybe I'd get good at it and then just like the randomly surprise place. people one day. But uh, I got a hand pan. A what? Hand pan? You're going to go hand and pan. have to say that like it's not a thing that everybody knows. It's like a, it's like this, it it's a musical instrument that's like, imagine like a, like a metal UFO. Wait, wait that's the like. Yeah. That goes like boo doo boo dee boo boo. Yeah. A steel drum? Yeah, it's, um, yeah, it's, it's kind of like that. Kind of like a steel Is drum. it like a steel drum kissing another steel drum? Like something you'd hear while you're in Key West. Yeah. It looks like a yeah. dome, kind of yeah. has like yeah. it has some some different pitches on the metal. Yeah. Like, Interesting. Dude, I love That's the sound cool. of those. Where yeah, did you get a... that? That's awesome. I don't know. I just like, I saw it one day. Oh no, I actually thought about, I thought like a couple years ago. You were listening to so, Kokomo by the Beach Bulls. So, <laughs> so at Ren Fair, at Ren Fair they sell them, but they're way too expensive at Ren Fair. But I was like, wow, that sounds really cool. And then I was thinking like, it's such a cool melodic sound. I love I it. I feel like it's like kind of calming. So I was like, yeah, I don't know, maybe I'll get one. Uh, so yeah, I got one. I could see myself getting one of those because I love the sound of them. Yeah, yeah, and you can't really harmonize. You can't really mess it up because it's like already tuned. It's just tuned. It comes tuned. So you're just like. And Bitterman says, "Hey Smosh, love the Try Not to Laugh video with Nez Declassified Crew. It was my favorite show growing up. Same, Brian. Same. I had never seen it, but I was very pleased. Never watched it either. Okay, I gotta go." Ian, thank you for being Love here. Love you. Hey guys, <laughs> welcome back to my YouTube channel. <laughs> Word, WordCross says do a barrel oh. roll. No. Oh. Bye, Chad. For $20? I'll Bye, Chad. Hey, thanks for the yeah. donos. That's very nice of you. Thank you. Uh, Bye, uh, Jenny <laughs> said, which game do you like to play more, Bepperdy or Who Memed It? I, um, I don't get to part. I, I, I host Bepperdy. Um, and you host Who Memed It. And I host <laughs> Who Memed It. Uh, but hosting Who Memed It's really fun because, like, I don't. I like to just look at all the memes and react, but hosting Bepperdy makes it tough because, like, I it would be mm. fun to participate. I got to host Bepperdy one time, and it was so fun. It is fun. But I, I think it's time. fun when you have like worked on the questions sure. yourself. Sure, that was the same. That was what it was for anime, which yeah. I was very stoked about. Uh, mm -hmm. You guys, if you haven't watched the anime one, you should watch it. That one was. It's not out. It's yet. not out. <laughs> Shane. Oh my god! Talk about a musical I'm show. My mind. Uh, it's coming out very soon. Uh, so. I'll, I'll promo it here. I don't give a shit. Ian, do you think Ian's mad at me? No. no. And if he is, we'll hit him. Um, I I personally, I enjoy Who Memed It more because it is so flipping difficult for me to figure out who memed it and they're all so funny. Like, mm. I, it's it's like a coin flip yeah. every single time and I'm like, like whatever, and I just get to the drill. Who Memed It's very yeah. fun. But uh, anyways, yeah, since I fucked up, it's okay. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, uh, I've been. I promoted actually in the last one that came out. Is no, it was really fucked up that you spoiled. Me. I said it. Uh, but we did a uh, we did a Bepperdy anime, and uh, I I did come up with a lot of the questions for it. Wow. And uh, I'm very she, proud of she it. She got a full chest tattoo. Yeah. Full chest. He got the big spider on the so back. Some of y'all know what I'm talking about. <laughs> um, what was I going to say? I like I like who it better because Bepperdy. Um, it's really a, a lot of, it's like scary to push the button sometimes. And then sometimes scary. if you get it wrong, everyone in the room laughs at you. And, <laughs> but at least in Who Memed It, like, we're all in on the joke, you know? Yeah. Um, someone said Shane I, Split goes to a different school. I'll, okay, I'll Audrey, I, I promise you, I am doing it. Someone I will said also, Shane, someone said I'm gonna, Shane Leak Jr. God, <laughs> that's funny. I will get personal here about the Bepperdy thing too. I have a hard time figuring out the vibe of Bepperdy because in any competition show, you're supposed to be like, try your best and we're gonna battle it out. But then if I do well, I start to feel bad about it. And then I'll also get comments where it's like, Damien's taking this too seriously. And I'm like, I thought we were supposed to do this. And I like, I fully acknowledge it's on me, but I don't understand. Like I literally just don't understand where the vibe is and how to find it, and it seems to come natural to everyone else. So I always get really stressed when I'm on Bepperdy. Yeah, it seems, does seem like an, like it's been like a long-standing internal battle. Yeah, because I'm like, if I do a good job, the yeah. comments are going to be mad at me, or I feel bad about it. Yeah. But if I, I mean, specifically just stand back and don't answer, I'm like, 
It's all about making a good video, right? Like right. having a good time and I'm just waiting for Jurassic Park Beppery for me to slay. It's true. Uh, <laughs> I my my interests are too not niche, but uh I don't know. Niche. I think we've all had our ones where we can just kill it. I, I will say, look, promoing it again. Anime felt like a very even match it for did. a lot of it. And it I did. was very happy with that. Um, tough thing oh is- Oh my God, look, her face hasn't loaded. Or oh has no. it loaded? Oh no, oh no. Oh. Or is uh, that just how it looks? On. Okay, I'm sorry. Calm I'm sorry. down. Uh, Tim says, hey guys, what was your favorite Smosh Summer games or Smosh Winter games? Uh, I've never had to do a Winter Games. We only did we a only did two, right? We only did two. Um, it'd be- <laughs> It'd be fun to. We didn't there yet. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Marta says, "Bestie, it's the autism in us. Don't feel bad." Thank you, Marta. Um. Thank you. Uh, yeah. No, that was uh right before I joined. Y'all did Winter Games. Uh. Yeah, it was the definitely the more expensive one. Winter Games. Dude, there was a royal cabin in Big Bear. Like, like everyone was in one cabin. But it was a royal cabin. What's a royal cabin? Like a like really a expensive big What's a royal cabin with you? Uh, yeah. Whoa, um, si she went silly mode. Say, stars. Winter games was fun, but they were never as fun as summer games. And uh, uh, a really fun one was Wild West, uh, looking back. I saw that someone was showing sharing the intro for that on Twitter, and I forgot how insane yeah, it was that wild. was. I edited that. You did? No yeah. Holy crap, man. Wow, great work. You go here? I go um, here. I did the freeze frames. I did all the fucking. I did the. I did the music. Regina I'm says. Like, proud of that one. You killed it. You did kill it. Regina says Shane is such a Chloe. Hey, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what that means. Why don't you like, Chloe Grace my ass? Hey. Um, Whoa, Q's money, man. Fifty bucks. The Twitch streams are some of my favorite ooh. Smosh content. All Courtney, love your Smosh character, especially Janice. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Wow. I was just. Mentioning Janice this morning because I literally haven't played her or even mentioned Janice. Old school. Super, She's super the one that's like. First I ever did on on Smosh. She lo I love eggs. <laughs> because this morning Selena was cooking eggs. She's like, I love eggs, and I was like, <laughs> I love eggs. She was like, What? I'm gonna look at this character. And then I have, and that's exactly how it went. And then it didn't. So end. she loves eggs. What's her vibe? She's just a weirdo. At first, you know her as Soup Girl, because she likes and she enjoys soup, and so she loves soup. And then <laughs> um, there's a the, there's a sketch called the Last Donut, where no one is like there's one donut left in a box, and uh, I've been there. It's like a bunch of people like, oh, should I take the last donut? And then it ends up I just don't is think she it. is she similar to um is she similar to who is the the Disney star character you played? Elizabeth Hines. Completely no, so different. Oh, okay. Yeah, because Janice. The last time you see Janice is in every drive-through ever. Okay. And I'm just like. Yeah. I'm gonna check out Janice. I'm gonna go home and check out Janice. I'm Don't. gonna go ask Janice. Don't. And the Uber video. Uber That's driver. Like, yeah, that was one of those ones where like, a, they needed. A, I feel like they needed a character for. A bit, and they're like, "Can you, can you do Janice?" I was like, "Okay, okay." <laughs> I, I want to rent a scooter. Uh, I want to try the challenge. Guys, we need to take this part seriously. Yeah. Okay. So, love, love horseback said, uh, "You honestly should do a literature bepardy and have Shane be annoyed at everyone getting the answers wrong." I, I dream about doing like a an literature English bepardy and, AP and English just one. like, just like English, like anything book related. I'm like, oh, I, f I will fucking no, crush I would, that I shit. Would like that too. Um, I do it because I fucking love books, dude. I do be, I did, I did be reading back in the day. I've been reading damn so much. I am ripping. This is nuts. Favorite trying to laugh character that only appears once. Curtis asks. Book, book, uh, suggestion for everyone in the chat. I just read this book called Tomorrow and Tomorrow and Tomorrow, and it's like the best book I've read in a long time. It is so good. Check it out. Kiana texted me that she cried at the ending. Yeah, man. It's incredible. If you at the end of any book, then turns out tomorrow ends up being the day. <laughs> <laughs> That's the the whole trick That's of it. The twist. Wait, uh, you want to try the challenge? Do y'all have a favorite one-off? Uh, uh, I I brought character? him back once, but I really liked when I was the detective that was uh, solving the case of Noah's friend's dead ass pet. That's such a great one. It was, a, it was one of my early ones when I was like fearless. So this is awful. This guys, we should do forty-eight. 
You know, this. a one-off character that I did that I kind of want to bring back, I just don't know where, is uh, it was, I was trying to make Courtney laugh and I came out as like this greaser and I had like a comb and I, I just went like this, I was just like, <laughs> I just want to be that guy more. Just like, oh my God, that's Jerry. <laughs> Love Courtney, you got this. <laughs> what shine? Or what smasher? <laughs> I'm just saying you're killing this. Whoa, did you three star that? Wow! It's a spirit out of And I want a sport tank pop. <laughs> Viper Game says, you guys are the funniest people I've ever watched. I love y'all so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Very sweet, Viper. He's like, I don't watch anyone else. <laughs> so. I only watch up. Rachel Maddow and this. <laughs> and Matt, well, Rachel Maddow's close. Let's do if I watch this slow, guys. Well, stream's, you not, do, stream's not built for that. You really do, though, usually. Sorry, guys. No, it's no, getting true. crazy up in here. <laughs> slow down. Okay, just kidding. Opposite of slow down. Oh, 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 shoulder. Ripping. Ripping, ripping. This is sick. It should play the Pokemon Bicycle theme when you do this. It should, be like it should play Kings of Leon. I think there is something I should be doing. Uh, FNAF Kid says, I love all your videos. I watch them every day. You watch all of them? There's a lot. Yo, you are you my dad? Because my dad does that. Hey, FNAF Kid. You know what would actually be... Oh, sorry. No, you go. You know what would actually be wild is if everybody here like loaded up a bunch of like Smosh videos, like playlists and just let them run while you were at work and let the ads play. Like that'd be so weird. <laughs> what if that was illegal? It's not. <laughs> That's the fun thing. Sometimes I will set, uh, like if there's a video I want to do especially well, I'll, I'll open up on my computer and let it play in the background even if even if we made it. I leave uh, Rhett and Link videos on uh, when I go to work uh, just cause I really want them to do well. And they are, and they're thriving. Good for them. I saw Weezer last night, and uh, Did Rivers they wrestle Cuomo Chili? looks like Link Neal. Rivers Cuomo. I want to do my makeup. <laughs> Rivers Cuomo. Jade, I want to do my makeup. Hey, hey Nuka Chloe, congratulations on coming out. You should be very, 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 very proud of yourself. Congratulations! 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 You won. Do my makeup. Oh. What's been your favorite memory at Smosh? Oh, Bree is wrestling. When I got this. Probably when I got this message from Bree saying, "What was your favorite message at Smosh?" That's probably mm. my favorite memory at Smosh. That's sweet. The masses needs a skinny and boneless. Who's skinny? Skinny was a character that I did to kind of add on to Courtney's boneless bit. It was just another, another post apocalyptic. Yeah. The Courtney freaking Miller to her boneless. Not really, like, it's just like... Boner? It's just another additional character Bone. in that universe. Ben. What's everyone's favorite band? Keep on being great, said Dismo. I think, before we before we move on to that, I, I really want to quickly say, I think one of my favorite Smosh moments going back to Summer Games was like, Shane and I had that, for the intro scene, battle scene on top of that roof where we're supposed to jump off and like fall off and you know, do the Wilhelm scream or whatever. And they had like a crash pad for me to land from a roof onto it and I was just like, all right, I'm just gonna do this. This is like one of my first bookings here. Like I'm gonna show that I can do this, whatever. And I do it and I land and I get up and everyone's face is looking at me like. You nearly And died. I was like, uh oh, what was the problem? They were like, you were very close to hitting the camera stand and off the crash pad. I'm like, oh. Yeah. Oh well, like. You, so you would have fallen 15 feet head first into a metal device. I would have hereditary for sure. <laughs> um, Honestly, I watched it and I was like, Oh my God. <laughs> and that was, a, that was the moment that I knew that this, everybody knew what they were doing at Defy. Um, what's everybody's favorite band, Spencer? Uh, I'm, I'm, just, I'm, I'm just wondering if that footage exists somewhere. I mean, it probably does. I, no, After because the, they didn't have an Defy angle on that. Oh. They didn't have an angle on that. It was just, it was the camera looking up that he nearly hit. Um, yeah, that would have hereditary real hard. Um, people are giving me some book suggestions. Uh, Jam says uh, uh, Human Acts by Han Kang, and then uh, Jason says Robin Hobbs' uh, Assassin's Apprentice. I have a few books uh, in my lineup right now. Uh, Damien got me uh, Priory of the Orange Tree. Yes, I which just started I, that too. I need to read. It's a big honking chunker. Boy. And the, uh, the sequel, or like the second book in that world, just came out. So I got to read it. And then I have uh, a horror novel called The Hacienda. 
Um, and then a sci-fi horror called The Daughter of Dr. Moreau. Whoa. Um, which is really cool. It's, it's, this author's kind of doing, she wrote, uh, I forget the, it's like Sylvia Garcia. She, uh, she wrote uh, another book called Mexican Gothic that I read, which is also fucking mm. awesome. Uh, she's kind of taking like old school, like horror tropes and kind of reimagining them in Mexico kind of settings. And it's, they, cool. Mexican Gothic was awesome. So I'm sure this one's going to be dope too. I hate cheese omg asks any of you remember your first interaction with the legend garrett Dude, garrett's honestly, been around a long time man just in general yeah. old as hell <laughs> no, he's, he's been with smosh and around smosh for longer than a lot of people probably know like he would pop in and around set when me and olivia were doing super like super sleepover so and then eventually they hired him. I went to Egypt with that guy. <laughs> I went to Egypt with that guy. It's true. Hey, I just wanted to watch this. Hey, hey, I'm Eric just was like our through. guide in Egypt. He's yeah, good, that's why he, just, he like, was. There. He's the most traveled person I've ever met. He he will just randomly talk about how he's been to every country, and I don't understand what the deal is there. Someone said yeah. who made the thumbnail. It was Tommy. Tommy made the thumbnail. For what? For this. Time. Aww. Yeah. Um, Jenny watched Saturday Night Live. So what are your favorite bits? And have you ever been inspired by any current or previous cast members, says Regina? I like when the credits roll. Oh, <laughs> owned. Um, Smosh is real sketch comedy. You know, like we my little my little pizza boy or my little my hungry little boys. Oh, the, the I am your mother? Is that the... No, no, it's, oh. it's, uh, it's, uh, <laughs> it's, it's incredible. It's uh, my hungry little boy. It's the Totino's one. Yeah. And then she kind of recurs the character when she makes out with Kristen Stewart in the kitchen. And it's like the French drama in the kitchen. Okay. While, like, is, all that, the boys... is that Fred Armisen? Like, is it still no, the no, same no, character? No, no. Okay, got it. Um, that reminds me, though, the fucking, the Zac Efron, uh, the the yeah. pizza commercial where it's like oh, Totino's yeah. pizza roll. It's like, wow, whatever. I am your mother. Yeah. <laughs> And that's before Hereditary. That's before Hereditary. It's like, hey, uh, I, you know, let's take that back. Um, it's really much just more of like a, you know, hey, you know, I'm, come on now, I'm your mother. And she's like, okay, I think I, I, I think I feel, I think I feel Got good for it. it. I am <laughs> your mother. Um, I was singing, uh, I threw it on the ground earlier today. Oh, that's a good that's one. An that's, that's an underrated. Nice. Uh, what about my, you? I, what have I been singing lately? No, what, what, what's your favorite SNL? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, I mean, the SNL digital shorts were my life. They changed you're my so life. Right. You're so right. Um, you're so real for that. What? what? Shy Ronnie. Um, oh, yeah. Yeah, Shy Ronnie is insane. Hey, 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 Sarah, we're gonna have sex. Speak up. <laughs> Speak up. <laughs> I should have paid Connie for that. Uh, folks. Uh, wow, I can't believe. Holy he's shit. <laughs> <laughs> Young uh, Pope from the HBO show? <laughs> uh, can't believe I've been on YouTube since 2006 and only discovered Smosh in the last few months. Honestly, it was probably better for your formative years, but we're happy you're here now. <laughs> we're like, we welcome on in. People who would be like 12 years old and they'd be like, I've been watching five years. And be like, you were too what? young to start. I'm not even joking. Someone at VidCon who was way too young said they were watching for us for several years. Opal Essence says, this week I found out that me and my hairstylist started watching Smosh in 2020. She's 25 and I'm 32. Trying to laugh is my entry to Smosh. And as a former improv kid, it brings me so much joy, especially the net declassified. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I, yeah, that's awesome. Did I beat the game because- I think you beat it. I, I think, think you did. I think this is think a 45 minute is game. Any, am I pissing anyone off in the chat with like, my casualism, like I think Bratz is probably not a well enough played game that people are gonna be like, oh, you completely un forgot to unlock the secrets. You I didn't get the blade of infinite eyes. I have not been taking advantage left. of your iframes though. There's no. What if you press left. X? What's your equip load? Go on my phone. Yeah, there's quests. I've <gasps> completed them all. Oh, there really aren't any quests. And the that won't even let me go to challenges. And then I can only go to two locations right it's now. It's called Stylesville, guys. This is sick. Clues, it's one clue that it won't let me do anything with it. Lauren, oh, happy birthday, Aaron Bell. Whoa, Aaron, another year? Another That's year, crazy. another year around the sun. You did it, Aaron Bell. And Lauren yeah, Wall, go, she... go for the record. Lauren Wall wants to ask us about the weirdest dream we've ever had. Um, oh man, I- I'm constantly having weird dreams, dude. Yeah, dog. Magnesium has been helping me sleep, but at the same time, it's like, you want something that makes melatonin look like it's for babies? <laughs> 
Do you want to relive all your trauma as though it were a carnival for a thousand hours, but you only got two hours of sleep? So Damn. most of my dreams are uh, really messed up and scary. See, I had a I, dream I, this week I, that Kiana came into to that Kiana took the week off, and I had a dream the other night that Kiana came in for the day. I was like, "What are you doing here?" That was <laughs> wild. That's so you valid. Cleanse your house. That's so valid. Uh, I I have done some stuff there, but um, I do you mean like with the burning of the? You need to do something. Yeah, because the problem is I was gonna do the like the burning of the sage and all that stuff, but like a friend of mine said that that is a who is a little bit more witchy mentioned that that is like a closed practice, meaning that it is supposedly more intended for indigenous peoples who practice it, and therefore if you don't know what you're doing, you're inviting other things in. Interesting. I heard that it's kind of like an antibiotic in that it just eliminates all energy. So if you do it too uh, much, you're eliminating good you energy. Crawl around well. on my own floor and just kind of roll around. <laughs> you roll around, <laughs> crawl around. See, I like to, I like to be naked and be sc so scary that any demons would be like, this place is fucked up yeah. and I need to get out. Um, oh, dude, I did have a moment last night that was really bizarre. It was like one in the morning and all of a sudden, like, I didn't have any lights on. There was no, like, lights on on the street. And all of a sudden, like, it was, I hear, like, and a bunch of lights go outside. And then, like, this big kind of kaboom, but, like, not an explosion. And then and Hagrid all came the... down the motorcycle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. But, like, all the lights went off and I, for, like, just a second. And then I, like, looked outside and the entire street was, like, coming back on. But it was such a loud, like, boom. And there was no like anything that was visibly wrong. No, that's just aliens. It was so it's weird. Just, that's not ghosts. That's that's aliens. Sounds like someone's um, doing a garage experiment. I don't see. I don't. I hardly ever have dreams. Uh, and when I do they have hard. dreams, they are uh, they're very simple and dumb. Like uh, the only dream that I can remember recently was me, there was no like fence or anything, but me and a, and a monkey just kind of trying to reach out at each other. And the monkey, we, we just kind of, we just kind of grab, we just kind of grab each other's hands for a second. He was just kind of like looking at me, just like, we just kind of grab our hands and kind of like, I would just kind of let go and he'd be like, that's the most shit I've ever ancestors. heard my head. Like that's, those are my dreams. Uh, um, Bree Porteous says, which Smosh moment would you relive? Uh, God. Uh, I, I wish we could go back and win the streamy again, and then I would do something dumber. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen the clip. It's fine. You just want, you, you know. That was I wish I would have dressed nicer. <laughs> it, was, it was too soon for like after I booked that job and I was still like wearing just like whatever I could find. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that, we were all kind of in that, that boat. Uh, Trailer Dave says, hey guys, you doing any more study, Shane? Why psychology? And are you more into the analytical side or just the theory of it? Any interest in philosophy mixed in there? Also, what's your favorite type of cloud? Also, have you had ice cream lately? <laughs> what's your favorite type? I like it all kind of. No, it's messy. Uh, um, Made sense. Just being silly. Uh, being silly goose. Um, yeah, the, I went to Silly Goose University. Um, I'm just being one of these. Uh, yeah. I'm not doing any more. I mean, I I, I want to pick up some more psychology books. I'm always uh, there. It is. There's a Silly Goose. Oh. Um, I'm always I do my nonfiction reading with audiobooks and uh, but it's been all over the place. But uh, I you know I debate on getting a master's at some point um, and going back. But I almost wonder if I'd want to do psychology or not. Uh, with psychology, I mean, with a bachelor's, it never got too specific. Uh, it wasn't too much on the scientific side. It was a bachelor in arts, so wasn't as much on the uh, research scientific side of psychology. But if I could go back, I might have looked at getting a BS instead because I think it might have been more interesting in the long run. Mm. But, uh, BS to me. Yeah, hey. it's total BS. Just um, like every degree. And I love trade school. I did love philosophy a lot. Um, I, you know, I took a couple philosophy classes and I really enjoyed them. Um, Cute. So, yeah, but I like, I like all the shit. So said, what's our favorite, uh, sorry, KJ says, what's your favorite D&D &D class to play if you play? Ooh, I like, uh, lately I've been having fun with Circle of Spores Druid. I've also been enjoying um, College of Spirits Bard. Um, they basically like roll a die to see what kind of ghost they're bringing into battle with them. Sometimes it's super helpful where you're just like, ah, this is the tale of like the spirit of a dragon and I get to like make it so that you breathe fire and all that stuff. But then other times it's like, 
spirit of Tom, and Tom is just kind of chill. And you're like, it's the most random, like kind of useless class, but you get to be all spooky. But I usually also play Arcane Trickster. Um, you, Damien was showing me a bunch of uh, classes and heritages and stuff, and uh, I was shocked at how many different types of animal people there are. Yeah. There's a hippo guy. Yeah, the, 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 the gif, I think they're called. Yeah, uh, It's jif. Jif. Uh, <laughs> Mom's like, you choose hippo man. Um, they're, but, from, uh, they're from Spelljammer. Um, yeah, I uh, I was shocked at how many. There were. Said, Are any more chosen and Brianna Boho bits? Those were so funny. They were, Those were, they were a good pair. Poppy Playtime? Poppy Playtime, Playtime that was, was very silly. Well, I streamed Poppy, Poppy Playtime terrible. and it actually scared the duty out of it's me. It's scary. It was very, but like, it was so, and it's like, yeah, because I wouldn't, I wouldn't enjoy playing that game, but watching no. y'all... I don't well, under... You did play it. <laughs> you gave away all the secrets today! <laughs> yeah, that was the secret. That I was say, actually, in secret. the one video, it's one of the, I think it's one of the, not coolest, because it's like... Wait, I was just saying you played it, I didn't say that... Oh, yeah, no, but I was playing the game, like, for Shane, yeah. and that, because, you know... So... Uh, I'm I'm down to talk about that because I think it's I'm actually more proud of the fact that we didn't no one give it. that off. Is so because we needed to fit it into a fast enough video, and I didn't have time to play it. Spencer played that game, and me as chosen is there pretending to play it while Spencer's playing it like six feet away, and so I had to be there pretending to be like, okay, so we're gonna do. <laughs> it came out great, and Shane could really focus on like just reacting. I was trying. We did it so that I could make fun of the game and like really have fun with it. But I would, uh, I would do. I mean, I I think that's kind of the way to do it. If I had time to play that game, I could have played it and done just fine. But like, you know, uh, but it was really funny. That was. I, I would like to do more. Um, those were really funny. Just yeah. want you to know that I'm at the airport for fun right now. Um, I, I will let you know, Courtney, I, I did see a few different people in the chat say go to the park. Yeah, I saw. Okay, yeah. just letting you know. I just thought it'd be funny to go to the airport for no, fun right it's, now. No, it is fun. Chosen. They're like, what are you doing at the airport? Oh, not too long ago. This is a fun little story. I was at the airport uh, over the uh, winter holiday and uh, I was with my sister and we did like the TSA pre-check line. So we like mm -hmm. got right in and we're like moving right along. Um, but they had this like banner there that looks like it was like made out of the same poster board that you use for like a science fair project or whatever and just had a bunch of pictures of guns with like 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 a no on there and I was just like I just turned to my sister I'm like oh did you hear about this yeah you can't bring just like a bunch of guns <laughs> you can't bring you can't just you just can't bring a bunch of guns uh anymore to the airport and times in their really pre-check but I'm like, it's also the pre-check line, which is like, they have to research you first and you're pretty sh pretty sure you have to like know what to not do. But it's literally like they slapped it together. They're like, oh, we forgot to tell people that they can't bring guns. Sorry, you can't bring a bomb onto this plane. Wait, I can't bring my bowling ball with a wick? <laughs> oh, Style. Man. Um, so Elias uh, was asking if we're gonna do D&D. &D, um, and you know, we're not quite ready to talk about anything yet, but we do have something cool planned for after Board AF Legacy, cause we're, we're, we're chomping through those years. Yeah, Up next, dude. we got, uh, what is it, the 20s are next? Well, I mean, so we've shot, we've shot, uh, when was that? Like the early 1900s? Yes. And, and then, then we're gonna shoot the 20s and So like we 50s. essentially have the 1900s left, and I think the Bath Legacy ends on 2004. So and the plans I've heard from y'all are nuts. They, yeah. These are gonna be absolutely the best episodes. It's crazy. We've stopped being people. Yeah. Uh, Shane is gonna be a little spider. Yeah, I, I fully know what I'm gonna do for the rest of Bath Legacy, and I'm so excited. Um, it's pretty great. It's getting it's getting crazy. Um, so she lost her ticket, and I can't find it anywhere. It's because she's running around like a at oh, the mall a movie bar. It's at the mall. This looks like a mall. No, this is the mall. We pull out our giant hammer. Wait, wait, wait. So, so which um which Sims game were you in, obsessed with, Courtney? Sims 2 changed my life, okay. mm. but I was very into Sims 1 and my mom, I only had it because my mom was obsessed with Sims 1 mm -hmm. and she would try and design custom skins onto her characters. Like she tried to put, yeah. expose my mom right now. She tried to put her boyfriend at the time's face onto a Sims face. Like a face off situation. Like a real like graphic design, pasting yeah. a photo of his face onto it. Honestly, that's awesome. Mood. Honestly, slay mom. Honestly, slay mom. And honestly, I do. I don't. Um, yeah, no, just because that screen reminded me of like in The Sims when it pulls out and you're like 
and you yeah, choose what part of town you want to go to. Me. And the game, like, gets all laggy. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. That game used to be so slow. Uh, the first time I played Sims 2 was at my stepsister's house at the time. And it took, like, a good 30 minutes just to get the game yeah. going. And then every it was just everything was so slow. But I was like, holy crap. This game is insane. Whoa, there's Sims 2 on the PS2 you can move around in third person? That sounds amazing. Sims 1 is hard to play. That is... Yeah, so I, I downloaded I downloaded all the expansion packs. I got it working on Windows 11, which was kind of a pain in the ass. Yeah. And then uh, there were so many dumb requirements, like for like promoting for like getting promoted in your job, that I gave up. I essentially rage quit that game because I alt F4 without saving. Did you break a controller? I didn't break a controller, but like mentally, I was pissed. Sims. Uh, Sims 4 Making Magic, that's a good one. I know the big Sims 4 expansion pack came out today. Oh, wow. Uh, someone said, when is Ian's funeral? Morgan says that. And uh, it was that was the live stream. That was our first was big the... Uh, mm -hmm. under the influence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was a good time. But, right. you know, who knows? Maybe we'll, well, maybe we'll revisit things like that in the future. We could always kill him for real. Yeah. Look, well, there's plenty of material for Ian. I don't think I, I didn't get a chance to roast him. I would like that. I would, I would like that very much. You guys might see that funeral one of these days. Who knows? Bob is playing Sims 4 right now. Just a reminder, y'all, we are planning a musical show. <laughs> <laughs> Ella said, bro, rage quitted Daniel Sims 1. I rage quit Sims 1. I, that was not 2. I, I am actively playing Sims 2. I will probably play it tonight. Uh, Sims 1 was the one I rage yeah. quit. I encourage any of you, you can, you can tag us on Twitter if you if you reach the highest level of any job in Sims One, I commend you. Honestly, yeah. I did. leave I did this stream that. right now. Yeah. Go play Sims One. I will Just say, I'm trying to see how mad I can get my boss at me. I was so I was so young when Sims One was a thing that I'm pretty sure all I did was immediately put my Sim into a wedding dress and play Dollhouse until I peed myself. Like the the IRL. doll the Sim peed himself. <laughs> me. I was like, how young were you? No. <laughs> so I shit myself and then booted up the game. Some of says, this day I've never met someone that matched my humor like you for. Thank you for endless entertainment. Wish you all the best. Well, thank you. Oh gosh, bless. Wish my, wish, wish my sim and sim Sims one had seen that message. Because, wow, he was a miserable son of a bitch. <laughs> Discmo says, hey, uh, what is your favorite game? Mine is Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. I like Fire Emblem Warriors. Three hopes for no reason. Um, Pretty sick. Well, uh, I like ABC Goldberg's The Game on... <laughs> It actually was an app game. There was, a, there was, a, there was an app game. Uh, I didn't get any money for it. So. Dude, I bet it was in it. Uh, my character's in it. So, Did you voice anything? No, I didn't. Uh, I didn't. I, I didn't. Like it was text? just an image. Um, real talk. Uh, Last of Us, Hades, and Breath of the Wild are like my top three. Let me answer. Of like me. the past. Answer for me. Sims Two. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Same, you think my favorite games ever? Courtney's yes. favorite game is Skyrim, y'all. Skyrim, Minecraft. I love Fallout 4, Skyrim, what? Minecraft, and Sims 4. Wow, it looks like Spencer isn't your real friend. Wow, that's crazy. <laughs> like, oh. but you know my past, I which is past. important too. Uh, you yes. care, please? You do. Sims 2. Okay. Uh, uh, Xanadu. Xanadu. Okay. And uh, 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 Precious. Uh, uh, I don't remember the name of it. Sorry for touching your tattoo. <laughs> uh, uh, I don't remember the name of it. Give me the first letter. You. Gentleman Broncos. You ruined it! I didn't think it was because of Broncos, the football team. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I think Brett Favre is in trouble? He only knows that because he's, you know. Max, uh, are you going to play Resident Evil 4 when it comes out? I would yeah. love to play Resident Evil 4. I'm definitely going to be playing on my own time. I don't know if it on this stream. Legend of Dragoon says Curtis Potter. Wow. Smart, smart. So Someone said Sly Cooper 2. I'm like, damn, that's a there's a niche reference. So is that here's what, or was that Sucker Punch? Oh, sorry. I was gonna say, here's what Curtis probably knows too. The difficult thing about Legend of Dragoon is that most of the experience comes from boss fights, yeah. so you can't even really grind in that game. And so, if you really want to min max, you got to make sure one or two of your characters dies in the boss fight, so the other character gets all the experience, and then the game gets really easy. Jesse, what the fuck are you talking to? <laughs> What the hell? I'm just connecting with one person who gave us two dollars to talk about Legend of the Dragoon, so I'm doing that. Skyla says, do you, any of you all like the original Fable? It's my all-time favorite Never game. Never played Fable. Loved Fable 2. I only played 3. Fable 2 
turned me into a gamer because that was the first game where I was like, oh, like, I can actually beat this because so many games I was, it like, younger. It was a very younger. casual, like, not not in a bad way. Like, Fable 1 was absolutely my yeah. comfort game. One of my, my best friend in 8th grade came over to my house one time, and I was like, oh, you want to check out this game? It's called Fable. He's like, oh, cool. And so I let him play the intro. I was like, oh, give me the controller. And, I, and I'm pretty sure I beat it. Did you I just beat the game. him? Yeah, yeah, give me um, the controller. So yeah, Fable 1, I've, I've beaten it so many times. Great comfort game. Super excited for the new one. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that teaser trailer we got three years ago. And apparently they're just going into production. Jesus, gonna, you're kidding me. I'm gonna me. call up John Microsoft. Uh, K no way. I beg your unbelievable pardon. Norway. Norway. Uh, Ian's Is gonna play F1 one right here. Wow, He's and he wanted, he wanted we, Forza Horizon to be real so bad. Because we spoiled all the next quarter's programming, isn't it? Uh, Kay says, who is Simply everyone's Ian. favorite bearded individual? <laughs> Strap in the Ian, it's going to be a bumpy ride. I finally got a beard. Oh, I pitched an idea to Santa. Ian. Santa. I pitched an idea to Ian, and let me know what everyone thinks. Okay. I'm down to do this some point this year. Okay. What if at some point this year we have a beard competition? You mean no? Oh shame yeah, we're talking about that. Where yeah. we're we're at just some some at some point we just declare it like all right the race is on and then in a couple months we we see who has the most epic beard. Yeah. I mean look, because you could grow a beard, can't you? Pretty powerful beard. Damon used to have a fucking epic beard. I'm yeah. gonna pull it up on my phone and then show the camera. You on did. My phone. I, it was crazy. It's gonna be great. I can't see the chat now. Y'all you know. are gonna oh, love that's it. Super sucks. You want to swatch faces? I mean, everyone's talking shit about you, so me? You don't want to see it. Someone said y'all slaying the house down. Bussy queen, XOXO. Thanks for the ten pounds, Amy. That's awesome. Dude, boots got the house so down. Awesome. Boots, pretty yeah. clat. Yo, you got a scooter? Curtis says I love you, Damien. Yes, grinding. Lady Clip, baseball, yo, and I'm a grandma. Grinding. Thoughts on Bodokai Tenkiachi 4? Um, I'm what? excited. Super down. What is that? It's, it's the, the new Dragon, Dragon Ball Z game. fighter game. Oh. My friend and I used to play the second one on Dang. Wii? Maybe? The fourth one is going to be really good. I'm calling it. We just, we honestly just thought saying, uh, we're going to go play some Dragon Ball Z Bodokai Tenkiachi 2 was <laughs> really funny. <laughs> that is funny. Tenkaichi. Is this your is this your pad? This Wait, tell me. Look at that silhouette. Look at that silhouette. Like just like imagine seeing that in a dark alley. I'm <laughs> sorry. It's like one of those popsicles that has the two buttons. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. That's some sort of fungi. <laughs> oh yeah, you know those little like mushroom, the little chocolate mushroom. Uh, uh, yes. Yeah, yes. 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 That kind of looks Treats. like that, yeah. You mean candy? Treats. <laughs> treats. Or, you know, well, like, like uh, it's Dairy candy. Queen. It's like Dairy a... Queen, it's, it's treat. Dairy it's treat. Queen! Rachel yeah. says, favorite queen, current anime, treat. and Raina, Ran, Rana says, Attack on Titan. Bro, the new Attack on Titan? I, I need to restart yeah, I, Attack on oh, Titan. Oh, man, I got I, I got a little, I almost, I, I almost. You almost shit your pants? I almost had a little tear. I almost, I had a little tear that was getting going. All right, time, Ian, time for you to, don't you to jam this up into the camera for, for beard. It's this one, all right. Everybody look at this. Whoa! That beard. And that was. What the and hell? I was yeah. 24. That's joke, Yeah, right? I was 24. That's cheap to realize because you've never really grown it out. Uh, no, but when people are like, Damien always has five o'clock shadow, he should take care of himself. That's freshly shaven. No, you yeah. look like a conquistador. <laughs> it's insane, man. That's It's epic. Um, I've never grown it out nearly to that length. So I, I at some point this year, I'm going to try. Yeah, your beard back in like 2017 was. Or I had one for a little bit. Crazy, and it was kind of fun. I uh, so I'm gonna probably have to shave this one soon, uh, for some Bath Legacy stuff. <laughs> but uh, I will eventually this year try to really grow this out as much as possible. I just can I just say something really quick? Yeah. I hate how this girl spells her name. Nine, nine. It's like how Shane spells his name. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I, saw so, I saw someone in the chat say that. I saw someone in the chat say that. Hey, you're really tense. Hey, Spencer, how far are you? It just looks like, dude, what if I made biscuits on you? <laughs> hey, Ian, you have a request up there. Oh, can Ian say slay for everyone? Tell him no. Well, you just did. Uh, as long as no one asks me to say Linux properly. <laughs> uh, refuse. Um, and Spencer, how far did I make it through Leisure Suit Larry? I've never played that. I played a There's little bit. There's the universe I'd want to be in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've never played them. I don't know anything it's about It's not good. I just spent $300 finding this girl's 
uh, concert tickets. Dude, welcome slay. to the economy, dog. Big slay. Welcome uh, to the economy. Shane, I, I can't imagine a game aging worse than those games, probably. Which game? Oh, yeah. Laser Suit Larry. Larry. Yeah. Oh, bro. That's Talk about a 90s. What about the um, uh, Gex? Yes. No. Oh to, yeah. my god! Dude. I saw those clips. Well, there's and I was like, like there's whole... no way this is real. There's uh, like where wait. he goes. Really? Oh, dude, it's so oh, bad. What's the one where he's like putting on like the oh like the they... accent? Oh yeah. <gasps> oh yeah. They do. They do some pretty awful dude. stereotypes in Gex. Um, it's, but it's like a whole level where he's like doing yeah, the accent. It's rough. Yikes. It's rough. Um, that's why Gex got that. Uh, that's why Gex is a skater. I'm gonna skate around the park. I never, I, Hit I people. never saw Gex. I never like saw any gameplay from Gex. But like, I feel like I always saw like the game like cover. Like whenever I went to like yeah. Oh, yeah. Target back in the day, his ass was slaying. <laughs> Has anyone seen I... the trailer for Arc Two with Vin Diesel? Yes, what? and I saw a picture. It was like, hey, does anyone else remember this? And it was just a picture of Vin Diesel shirtless, like riding the dinosaur. And I was like, God damn, I forgot about this. So Arc Two is gonna come out, and it's starring Vin Diesel. That's awesome. Oh, That's wild. Man. Oh, didn't they have like a super like CG trailer yeah. like yeah. a couple years ago? Wait, I saw a meme based off of that. It was like the CGI Vin Diesel's face, and it was like. Uh, scientists have reconstructed what Adam <laughs> likely looked like at the beginning of time. <laughs> That's very funny. That's great. Trash Bob asking if anyone else shits their pants. Uh, that sounds like a you problem. <laughs> yeah, but everybody sometimes gambles and loses. Like you try to sneak That's out a little far and then you're like, whoops, and then you gotta go away. Right? Abby right? says Abby wants to see an eater eat it in character. That, that that's does sound pretty, pretty fun. That's a pretty funny idea. Augustus would slay. Y'all are about to see this. Oh, that squirrel is the best. You oh got, my god. Oh my god. Like to call the Kirby. Is, would you call that? <laughs> would you say that squirrel is serving seaward? Come on. Ian, no, serving I not. think you okay. have to go. I, think I don't know. I don't know. trust the man who killed a rat it's yesterday. Serving nuts, guys. It's serving nuts. Wait, wait, wait. Time out. Look, look what this girl's name is. Fiana? Yeah, nobody has a name here that makes sense. They, they had... It, no, it's, it's not. Fiana. It's unfortunately Fiana. Dude, this thigh it's gap. Like, this is unrealistic yeah. uh, yeah. beauty standards. But this is how I think I look. By the way, as far as uh, going back when someone was saying favorite animes, I did finish uh, Chainsaw Man. That shit was awesome. It's great! So cool. So good. I wonder if there's a question about it in fa uh, uh, Family Guy Legacy. <laughs> family, <laughs> family Guy Legacy. Family Guy Legacy. That has been, that has been, uh, 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 Beverly Bever 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 Anime. Beverly anime, yes. I wonder if there's a Chainsaw Man reference in there. I'm just going to pull up the upcoming slate and just show that to the camera. Yeah. <laughs> I say it. I wonder if someone gets it more right than the Same. answer on the card. Yeah, oh, sorry, oh. I don't remember Asuka's both of her last names. It's your favorite anime. You have okay. a picture of her at your desk. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. Who? Asuka. It's Linex. <laughs> I was proud of my line. Y'all stop bickering. They okay. fine. We'll go on a they full made, on battle. They made fun of me for saying Linux, and then they made fun of me for being like, "Oh, I don't PC game, so I don't know anything about it." And they're like, "It's not even a PC game." That's, well, that's, 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 that's the thing about Linux. Thing you that's could have just said. that's just like syntax for English. Like, there's why would it be? Why would it, why would that? Why would that? I be a Someone in super chat asked if we knew Zombo.com. That was, that was one of my favorite things ever. This is Zombocom. Where's the Someone Zombo. gives you a blank check to do whatever project you want. Uh, the, oh. Retirement. <laughs> <laughs> Quit this shit. <laughs> really uh, cool. This oh, really Someone asked if I play Final Fantasy 14. Yes, I do, but I've gotten out of it. I want to return with some friends. Um, I only logged back on to get the most recent update, uh, Shadowbringers, and so I could become a bunny boy. I could finally become a, uh, a male Viera. Uh, for a lot of you, you don't know what that means, and that's okay. That's just for me and the person that asked. Is that like, what's her name from uh, Final Fantasy XII? Friend, yeah, but... Um, is that they, like Lola Bunny from Space Yes, Channel? exactly. <laughs> but it's a, it's, a, it's a race that is you've only ever seen like the female version of because they all, like, their entire society, everything that, like, is political and hunting and all that stuff, it's all, like... The woman version, and they've never shown 
w are there even male Vera? And so they basically added lore where they're like, yes, but though they're nomadic and they return every like five years. And so I was just like, hell yeah, now I'm a male. now I'm a hot bunny boy. <laughs> the, the, the male bunnies return every couple of years. Just like hey, we're here for the sex. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. We don't hey, want to uh, politics. We're here for snoo snoo. <laughs> Yeah, I don't, I don't want to. My, my character has one ability and it's Snoo Snoo. Dude, look at this, look at this person's weird name. It's Yoga Fawn. These names are unhinged in this. Uh, of dance battle. Are, are we going to harmonize? Oh my god. I think it's. Oh good. yeah, somebody asked us to harmonize. Oh, Brooke asked us uh, to harmonize the word slay. Oh, sh Ready? it's Endwalker, not Shadowbringer. Oh, it's up. Right? Oh. Go. And. Slay. Which that was bad. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Has have any of you played Power Washing Simulator? Lots of goo. Uh, yeah. So honestly, that game was not relaxing to me because of the constant sound of the power washer got really grating to me. Oh, uh, I can see that. And you really have to like get in there. Like you can't just chill and like. No, it's like you miss a speck of dirt over there. It's like goddamn. I'm I'm sorry. Can we can we pump the brakes real quick? Did you just read that man's name is Yoga Fawn? That's what yeah. you're saying. Yeah, it's, it's it? Yoga Fan because you're no, doing yoga. No, no, it's Yoga Fawn. Yeah. Let me double check. I'll talk to him. It was. It's a crazy. See, it's, it's, he's a fan it's of yoga, yoga Fawn. Okay, okay. You got like you know, Yo Yo Ma. <laughs> it's Yoga Fawn. Hold up. Let him cook. <laughs> <laughs> all done. But, and we all know Yo Yo Ma, right? I do know Yo Yo. From Glass Onion? Yeah. Yeah. I forgot though. He, Everyone someone said all Glass the audio fizzled out in the head. Oh, apparently the the audio mic said no to our, our, our harmony. Oh, really? I think so. Denied by the microphones. Really? That's, that's crazy. Let's do it again, ready? That super sucks. Do we have to do it really quietly? Yeah. Okay. okay. Wow, okay. Uh, yeah, I've seen Castlevania. That shit is awesome. All right, three, two, one. Slay. Oh, what if we did, what if we did Slay? What if we did Slay, but in the tune of the Halo theme song? It's the song of time now. <laughs> 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 Dude, the Steve Vai remix. Dude, do you remember when Hoobastank had a song in Halo 2? It was so good. Hoobastank <laughs> was amazing. Uh, uh, they were truly the 30 second smarts of Hoobastank. Did Incubus also have a song in Halo yeah. 2? Honestly, guys, thank you and so Breaking much Benjamin. because now yeah. I'm going to be blasting Halo music in my oh, car man. for the rest of the week. I've been listening to Undertale remixes. They're pretty good. Hi, I'm Yoga Fan. This is my brother, Yugi Fan. <laughs> That's where you're wrong, Paiva. What did Oliver say? My my Yu-Gi-Oh TikTok did pretty well. Alex, yeah, that's awesome. It was very funny. Alex, what, what's the <laughs> Alex roll the clip? Yeah. Hey Shane. Yeah, oh, has anyone seen Castlevania? That's a big favorite. Bring back the anime topic again. Back on the anime topic again. Let me get Castlevania, a pretty good. The better one, Cyberpunk. Edge Runners. Yeah, Edge Runners. Castlevania is friggin' awesome, Edge though. It was honestly a major It slay. was so. Was it the same studio? No. no. But it's just like, it's a Netflix video game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anime. Um, I wanna get I'm such a fan Kira. of Castlevania. Love that I shit. never, I never. I want to do. I want the people. <laughs> I, I want the people who did Castlevania to do Metroid. I want them to do a super dark, sci-fi like noir Metroid. I don't I, want that. Hmm. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> no. I don't want that. I don't want that. Um, I don't. Yeah, I, I don't know how they. So I don't know how they managed to pull off like such a good anime with with cyberpunk. Like yeah. it was just like it was so good, and I was just like, it was like comically good. What? I was like, no way. Yeah, Ian and insane. I talked about it. It made both of us revisit cyberpunk. Yeah. Yeah. Also, like the choice of Franz Ferdinand for the the intro, uh, not expected. It is very it much was appreciated. Really dope. It was pretty. You know what it reminded sick. me of is uh, Ghost in the Shell. Head Ghost. Gits. Gits. <laughs> gits? Yeah, People the real fans gits call good. it. Gits the real good. fans call it Gits. Okay. okay. I have. It took me so long on the internet for people to like understand that Gits was Ghost in the Shell. I would just never think to say that. Yeah. 
Uh, yeah, but uh, my favorite Scarlett Johansson film. Sure. Oh, oh God. I never watched that. I actually started watching it on a plane, and, and uh, people were walking out. You know what? <laughs> you know what? You <laughs> know what people... Out. I walked out. I saw a movie, and I walked out. Uh, actually, you know a great movie... Just gonna throw this out there because some people talk about it is Under the Skin with Scarlett Johansson. I never saw it, but she shows, no. her, she shows her boobies in that, right? I don't sure. think so. Uh, but it's a mess because yeah, she's like up. a naked alien. It's scary, and and she's she's great. yeah, right, it's freaky. Question it's freaky for Shane. Uh, uh, Kay says, uh, question for Shane and Ian. If you could only pet the cats owned by one of the people in that room, who would it be? In this room? Met your cat, Spencer. I haven't met Spencer's cat. Yeah, met... none of y'all have been to my place. Yeah, yeah can you can I come over for yeah. once in my life? Every cat's great. Uh, yeah. My cats are very soft. I will say that. My I cats are better cats. than uh, most yeah. cats. <laughs> oh my. They're very soft and very sweet, and they've never bitten anybody, and one of them is obese. I think we should have a day here at this office, where instead of people being able to bring their dogs, everyone who has cats should bring their cats. That would be a disaster. We should let them run loose and we should let them be in. Whatever happens, happens. My cats would be good. Yes, uh, Squishy loves people. Um, really? Mitch Ramsey says, love you guys with $37. Thank you, Mitch. Oh, wow, Mitch. That's very sweet. Thank That's you. That's a very specific number. My last. Impractical yeah, Jokers on Try Not To Laugh would be so sick. I just don't know how to reach out to them. Jay LeBron says, what's my most used custom keyboard? Um, the one, uh, I have a key, no, no, it's the glorious, uh... How many keyboards do you have? Like eight or nine. Do you swap yeah, them for, like, depending on the game? No, not really. I usually stick to one. The rest are for display. Oh, yeah, we never finished uh, Discmo's uh, uh, favorite bands question. We didn't go around. That's true. Uh, uh, so, so mine's probably Weezer. Like, sorry to be that guy. That's a no, weird Russell that Jimmy, guy. Dude. That's, That's fine. I, I, like, nobody knows the music I listen to. I'm not, I'm not trying to say that in a pretentious way, like... They're called the Beatles. <laughs> 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 I listen to a lot of random music by people that are not, like, very well. So they're called Tame Impala. And... <laughs> <laughs> dude, everyone loves to shit on Tame Impala. They're pretty fucking no, Tame Impala is great. Tame Impala's it's just that good. hipsters really like yeah. it's, no, it's like, yeah. it's unfortunate when anything that's, like, genuinely cool, then people start to make fun of, like, oh, you're so unique that you like Tame Impala. Wow. And then everyone kind of is like, oh, okay, I won't. Yeah, sometimes it's okay to just like things even though other people also like them. What was the like, question? Favorite band? Favorite, favorite bands. bands. Oh. You know what? I, I, I don't really I have, like... God, every day. I don't Once have, like, a, a uh, I don't have, like, a current, like, band that I'm right now, like, that's my favorite band. I did listen to an album recently, uh, and, and it was the first time in a long time where I listened to an album where I liked every song, and it was by the Nova Twins. Mm. That shit was awesome. They Never kick heard ass. Of, never heard of these guys. Um, and then, frankly, uh, just a song that I like. Dude, I'm, I'm into that, that Ice Spice song. Oh. That song the is good. Alex the, freaking out, wait, too. Which one's Ice Spice? Ice Spice, she's the Spice Girl you forgot about. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, she's uh, which which song though? Yeah, oh, Boys wait, a liar. Uh, to Boys a liar. See, I, I don't. That one, that one doesn't. That one doesn't really. I don't know. It's I work like it. it Boys a liar. Alex freaked the fuck out. I love that song. He did a Alex full back foaming in yeah. the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> He's <laughs> where a cat is about to pass in a hairball. And you're gonna, you're gonna trigger. Some but Ice Spice sorry. has become on on TikTok and Twitter. Ice Spice has become the thing where it's like, this is what differentiates millennials and Gen Z. Is like, and and I will say, a lot of millennials were responding, saying shit. I swear to God, like, what's an Ice Spice? And I was like, shut yeah. up. God damn it! You're making millennials sound so stupid when yeah, you say yeah. stuff. I like saw that. TikTok the other day that like TikTok. I was talking about this with Courtney earlier. TikTok has really gotten like heavy into the Gen Z versus millennial thing. I know. Which I, I know like generationally people are always gonna be like, ah, but like Gen Z and millennial have the most in common of any other like generation that is out there. Like I grew up playing Neopets and like a YouTuber that I watched that is a young Gen Z, it also just did like a deep dive on Neopets. Like there's so much that unites us. So, but like I'm starting to get a lot of TikToks that are like, reacting them to millennial humor and it'll have like a million views mm -hmm. and then oh when it'll God. show when it'll show like someone else's video like it'll be like videos been privated or videos been removed i'm like you're just bullying millennials off of you know, you know tiktok and i'm starting to get thing? comments like go back to facebook and i'm like dog what just don't watch my thing no like, you're, we're old now uh, uh <laughs> and, we, so. and we should probably just yeah we should probably just die at this point yeah, i guess so um but i i think i think one thing that i want to see come back is is like being acceptable to be cringe because i feel like 
it's like you can't you can't be cringe anymore. You cringe, bro. You know, it's hip to be cringe. Like I want I want it to be cool to be cringe again. <laughs> like you can't. Like how are we supposed to how are we supposed to like create better content? How are we supposed to create better content if we're <laughs> if we're afraid of like being like oh no but people might find this cringy. Like you gotta you gotta. You gotta break past those boundaries. Well, that's the thing. Like, I I feel like we we took a step back, right? Like, we started to get to this point, like, especially post, you know, obviously we're still in the pandemic, but it's like everybody spent years being like, holy crap, we had to waste our lives inside. So we all came out like full force, being who we wanted to be. Like, people went through fashion changes, people went through lifestyle changes, people went through all these different things. We're like, I'm gonna be unapologetically myself. And now we're stepping back again, being like, oh, who? nobody thinks the word. Uh, no. I will add on to that. I think TikTok was at its funniest in 2020 when everyone was stuck in their homes and yeah. everyone got so weird. Yeah. yeah. Everyone was fucking weird. We stopped judging each other. We were being. It was all cringe. It's to anything can be cringe if you deem it as such. Sure. But uh, you're right. We've kind of gone back to like trying think, yeah. to appease everyone. That and... meme of like like uh, the I am cringe but I am free. That was a good one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, Sebify asked, would y'all do another under the influence show? Uh, maybe not. An, I mean, look, who knows what we're gonna do? Certainly not mm -hmm. us. Certainly not us. I don't talk. Know. I don't talk about anything that we're doing. I, look, I, I think we we like doing those live shows, and and we would like to do. More. I really so just just for reference, um, our our boss is uh behind the camera behind the computers over there, and I just keep watching his face just for fun, cause like this is a rare moment where like I'm live. I'm on camera. I have all the power, Joel, and just watching him squirm is just. Oh, Joel's been in here this whole time. Yeah, it just gives me the giggles. Um, you see, so all my passive aggressive comments. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's been a delight, honestly. And uh, I'm joining in and making direct eye contact, and it gives me, I don't know, I guess you'd say I get my jollies off of it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Lauren Wall says, hi Shane, do you still play guitar? Uh, I don't. I I tried, the guitar was something in the pandemic. I was really, <laughs> like, no determined to like play, I was like, I want to get good at guitar. I want to play it, and I just, I just think you can't couldn't ride your thing. Do Let me it. in. Let uh, me in. <laughs> I've had a hard time picking up an instrument in my adult life. Um, so, heavy. yeah, they are heavy. Um, nice, dude. But uh, you know, uh, maybe someday, maybe you know, I'll do what Ian's doing. I'll I'll get that steel drum. Dude, it's a hand pan. Dude, uh, well, it's technically it's technically what I have is a tongue drum. But it's it's kind of a fall. Yeah. <laughs> so it's so so where where a hand pan is like you have you have grooves that are in the thing and each groove kind of makes a different noise. The, the tongue drum is a you have steel. You Boulevard, man. You gotta go. <laughs> it is a steel dome that has that has these cuts in them, and each cut you hit that little tongue and it makes a different. It's, Tuned to a different frequency. Hey Trey, thank you, thank you for the thank you for the donut. I can't tell that. I don't know. Okay. I wonder if Spencer drank a Mountain Dew today. He drank two. <laughs> Do you drink two every day? I'm uh, I'm I'm moved up to two a day. It's not I, I it's not I'm not proud of it. You gotta go cold turkey. Have we, like have me, we right? done Spencer's funeral yet? Because we might have to. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Guys, we only have three minutes left of the stream. Anything you want to say to the dear people? I, I feel like we haven't made fun of tongue drum enough yet. <laughs> I haven't even beat the game yet. Why are you making fun of my passion? This is, look, look at that weird name. Why, why, why are you? Oh. Talent oh, show ta man talenti, man talenti man show manager. Menagier. Menagier. I know, what's the sitch? It's 10 minutes to curtain. Better take 30 minutes to complete one task from this task. Dang it. Wait, sorry, is there actually voice acting? I haven't been listening. Yes, and they're doing a great job. <laughs> no, they're saying things like... Someone suggests doing a Turnout to Laugh episode with the Stark Kid cast. Interesting. Oh, yeah. interesting. Oh. interesting. Well, maybe we'll keep that in mind. Interesting. Trey, thank you again. Love you guys. Y'all give me so much joy. Well, look at that pose. I gotta try that pose. You gotta do the beast pose. We should have Brandon rate these photographs. A thumbs up is not bad. When did this game come out? Pretty recently. Like, like very 2012. recently. 2012. Okay. <laughs> We've got to take selfies with all these baddies. Again, strike a pose. Strike a pose. Goy a goy. Okay. It looks you like You remember this, Brad? <laughs> it's the boy. What, is, what does that mean? Get Germa on trying to laugh. 
Oh, That'd bro, awesome. I shouldn't have read that out loud. That's so messed up. That's a bad word. No, Germ is a streamer. He's really fucking ah. funny. Uh, oh, God. Crap. Wow, you whiffed that one. Only got $8. Suck. Germa made an appearance in uh, in the video we shot the other yeah, day. Yeah, the battle Say stations. What? Cool. Yeah. Audrey nice. Fox, you for over a decade. Wow. Oh my goodness. Why? Thank you guys for hanging out with us and and like this is the first stream of hopefully many. Yeah, yeah and honestly, Finley. happy birthday. And honestly, happy birthday. Honestly, happy birthday to everyone. To honestly, happy birthday, birthday and sorry for to, your loss. To anyone who has a birthday out there, happy birthday. To anyone who has ever had a birthday. Happy birth. Whoa, where am I? It glitched. What it the, glitched. What the hell? Can anyone go through a hard time right now? It oh, will get better. Stage. Or maybe not. I don't know your life. <laughs> Keep it up. I don't know what's going on. Okay. Uh, okay. uh, any oh, more we things can we can say we that make Joel mad? Uh, okay, guys, guys, stick around. I want you to stick around and watch these pog ass graphics we have for our stream ending. Oh. It is really yeah, sick. They be pogging. Hi, right. you King wants Damien to wear more Godzilla shirts. I wonder why they want that. I only own one. So if you want to mail a bunch of Godzilla shirts to my P.O. box, that's up to you. See you guys very soon. Guys, that was fun. This was a favorite time on Bye.